So you might be stuck in a situation where your iPhone is just not wireless charging. Now, what does this mean? Well, basically you might have your iPhone as you normally would like this, but when you place it on a wireless charger, your iPhone is not wirelessly charged from that specific device. Now, the first thing you wanna do is make sure your iPhone supports wireless charging. Some iPhones do not support wireless charging. So if you have an older one like this one, the iPhone 6S, 7, you know, or below, those ones do not support wireless charging. So keep that in mind. However, if your iPhone does support wireless charging, the big thing you wanna do and make sure is that your iPhone and the wireless charger are compatible. There are some wireless chargers that are not compatible, meaning if you try to use an Apple Watch charger on your iPhone, it's not gonna work. If you try to use a Samsung Galaxy Watch charger on your iPhone, it's not going to work. So make sure that charger that you're using is compatible with your iPhone as well. On top of that, whichever charger you're using, you wanna make sure it is fully plugged in. There are lots of times that I'm looking for my wireless charger, I can't find it, but there are lots of times where you go ahead and plug in a wireless charger and the charger may be the issue. I say the same thing with other chargers as well. If you're even plugging it into the bottom of your iPhone, make sure that it is a compatible charger and make sure it is fully working. Because if it's not, that is going to be a problem with the charger and not with your iPhone. Ultimately as well, if there's another issue going on, you may wanna make sure that that charger again isn't the issue. You may also wanna make sure you don't have a crazy big case on your iPhone as well. And if you have a metal thing on the back of your iPhone, I, I know some people who have like the like a magnet on the back of their iPhone, which they can like stick to a stand in their car. If you have that on the back of your iPhone, that's also going to stop you from charging your phone as well. And I think some of the MagSafe wallets as well stop you from charging or wireless charging your phone as well. So those are some big things to keep in mind. Otherwise, it's pretty basic. There's not anything else crazy going on with it. And then that's pretty much how to fix it. You can also try updating your iPhone as well. That's another thing you can do, but those are pretty much the main ways to do it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that would mean so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.